Hey guys, what's up? It's Mike here, and today is the last day of January, so I figured why not? Let's look at the entire Spin Master collection that I currently have. Um, I currently have 33 or 34 trucks, and most of these are duplicates as you see right here. The reason for that is because I'm basically collecting every version of the truck, and right here we're going to start off with El Toro Loco. We're going to start off with this one right here. This is the black Monster Jam one, Logo one. Or variation one, if you will. So we got that one. And then we also have this one right here. This is the gray Monster Jam logo version of it. Now, I used to collect these a lot when I was younger. And I got basically all of them from like 2000 to like 2005. Which is pretty cool. Um, this is actually my newest truck in the collection. It's the final edition El Toro Loco. And this one I um, just picked up yesterday actually so this one's pretty cool i actually like the red rims on this one a lot so that's el toro loco i'm pretty sure there's only three versions of them but that's pretty much it for him next up is the bounty hunters and this one with the phone number this was one of my first trucks i ended up getting this one i think i got it like january 3rd or so oops and this is the uh I, this one's kind of hard to find actually because it has the phone number on the tailgate and the phone number on the roof So that one's pretty cool and then here's the final edition of bounty hunter this one The only difference is there's no phone number on it whatsoever. This one's pretty rare to find but now I think more people are starting to find it once Walmart's getting more shipments in and everything like that. So there's five the next two trucks are the Dalmatians or the monster Dalmatians and like in the review video I said for these, the only difference is the whiskers and the blue collar and basically the ears. But these are actually in my top five favorite trucks. I think there's only two versions of them currently right now. And these are technically both of them right here. So those are them. Now this one I'm still looking for. Um, Megadon is probably my favorite one. This is the black logo Megadon. There is a gray logo. I cannot find it. And then here's the mud or the playset Megadon. This one is the gray logo. And there is another version of the black logo one that's currently out. But that one I haven't seen anywhere. So that's pretty uh, pretty rare. But Megadon is definitely one of my favorite. And I only have two versions of him so far. And going ahead here with Max D. Um, Maximum Destruction. When I stopped watching Monster Jam, this truck was like brand new. So, yeah. But anyway, I only have two versions of them. Uh, the version without the spikes on the side. And then, of course, the final version of him with the spikes on the side and the orange rims. The one I'm missing is currently the playset one. I don't have that. I've been seeing it everywhere. I just haven't really picked it up or anything because, I don't know, I just really haven't yet. <laughs> Not really an excuse for that. The next two... Or the, uh, the, what is it, double demolition pack or double downs pack, showdown pack, whatever you guys want to call it. But the uh, Gre Grease Monkey, Jesus, Gas Monkey Garage uh, truck right here and the Burrow Dozer. I like this truck. This is pretty cool. Um, it's pretty cool that it's a diesel monster truck too in real life. And actually, I do watch this show on TV. So Gas Monkey, it's pretty cool. It was pretty cool when they went up against Street Outlaws and all that. So pretty cool I got these trucks. They were actually one of my first double down pack along with these two um i got both of them at the same time dragon is amazing i love the casting on dragon and jester that's a pretty cool purple truck don't know too much about this truck but this one's really really cool looking and i love it it looks amazing to be honest the next couple trucks are gonna be i only have one version of son of a digger and this one might be the Mix 2 version. Not too sure. It was in a single pack. I got it at a Target in Rockaway. And I have never seen this truck again. The only time I see this truck is when it's in the uh, the playset. And honestly, that's it. So this truck, pretty cool. I like it. A lot of people don't have it, I suppose. It is pretty rare as of right now. But I am looking for the other two versions as we speak for this one. Another rare truck from mix two i believe is scarlet bandit 
I've never seen this truck again. I saw it once, the same time I got Son of a Digger, and I don't know why this truck is so rare, at least in New Jersey, but it is pretty rare. A lot of people want this truck. Um, this is probably going to be the next truck I make a review on, maybe, I don't know, but this one's really cool. Um, I remember Scarlet Bandit at like the World Finals, like World Finals 2 and everything. The truck looks completely different now than what it did back then, but this is a pretty cool truck little trip down memory lane if you will so yeah i only got one of them another truck i only have one of is pirate's curse i've been looking for the red rim pirate's curse but i'm not too sure like i don't know why up here it's so hard to find these trucks but this was one of the first trucks i got i got this probably like right after new year's not even and you know this compared to the hot wheels one it's it's insane how much spin master really put the effort into this truck so this is Pirate's Curse. I believe there's only two versions of him. Uh, if you don't count the Double Down Pack with Megadon, yeah, there's two versions. That's the third version with Megadon, so that's pretty cool. Here's another one I'm looking for. Um, this one, Wonder Woman. This truck's pretty cool. I like what they did with the lasso on it and everything. This one is currently the black logo Monster Jam. Uh, I think the other version is the gray version, and there's only two variations of this truck. So I am currently looking for the gray version of this one, just you know, just to have it in the collection and everything. So hopefully we can find that one pretty quick. All right, so now we're going to get to ones that I have a decent amount of. But before that, we'll look at this because this is pretty rare. We got the zombie green rims and the zombie blue rims. Um, I saw this once. And it was like the first two weeks of the year. After that, I've never seen a green rim or never seen a blue rim one again. So the next time I saw one, I didn't even care. I just jumped on it, got it, and I haven't seen it since. So this truck is pretty rare. And like I said in the other video, the only difference with this truck and that truck is the rims. And the ear on this one is a clear. And the ear on this one's painted just like the uh, face, I guess, the gray. So that's really it on that. But that zombie blue rim might be the rarest one I have. And then we got this one. This one I just got in my last video. This truck's pretty cool. Uh, Soldier Fortune. I don't know why I keep wanting to say Citizen Soldier. I got this song stuck in my head. But um, yeah, this truck's pretty cool. Don't know much about it, but it is a cool looking design. I know there's a double down pack with this truck and the Black, Op Black Ops one. So I'm looking for those two, but as you saw in my hunt video, this is pretty, um, these things are pretty rare. But this one's pretty cool. This one you get from the playset. Um, I love it. It looks cool. It feels cool. So that's another one right there. And then we're going to move on to one. <laughs> Blue Thunder, a.k.a. the Bigfoot of Monster Jam. Now, I'm not too sure how many versions of this truck there are, but I got the Gray Rim one, which... I don't know if this is the final version or if the dark blue rim is the final version. Not too sure. I got to look that up. Um, I'm pretty sure there's just three counting the play set, the one with the mud treads. This one's pretty cool, but I do like the gray version just because it reminds me of Bigfoot in some ways. So that's pretty cool. And yeah, I'm pretty sure there's only three versions, but hopefully there's three. I, I, I don't know. Maybe as I'm probably just going to drop this on the floor. Yep. And then to go along with Blue Thunder, we got the two versions of Storm Damage. The only difference is with these two versions is on the top, one's a glossy finish and one's like a matte finish. That's the only difference. And other than that, I'm pretty sure the logos on the side look identical. They're both the black logo, I think. Black logo. Black logo, yeah. So the only difference is really the finish, the gloss finish on these two. Um, this is a pretty cool looking truck. It's like a retro kind of body and everything. So the old kind of look, I guess. So that's pretty cool. All right. And then we'll get into these. So the Wildflower, the green rims, and the pink rims. Now, this was the first version of it. This one's pretty hard to find now. Um, I've been looking, and I've only seen the green version one. So, if you guys have this one, count yourself lucky because I don't know if you can get it again. But, it's pretty cool. I was able to jump on this one. 
This one I got in the Newton Walmart, and I basically jumped on it, just said, screw it, I'm going to get it, just to have it. And, yeah, so, pretty cool, I got both versions. And, of course, I've saved the best for last. Good old Grave Digger. I got four of them. <laughs> now, <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of Grave Diggers here. But, um, so anyway, here we go. I got the, uh, I guess the version one here with the name not going away to the back with the gray rims. This was the first Grave Digger I've seen. I haven't really seen it since. So I, I just jumped on that because it was the first, kind of like the first truck I really got. Then we ended up getting, what is it right here? This one. This one that came with Wildflower. And this is the uh, the version with the pink rims on Wildflower in the Double Down Pack. I haven't seen it, so it might be rare now. And then I saw this one up in Newton Walmart. Jumped on it, got it, because I wanted the green rim one. And like I said, I'm just trying to collect every single version of the truck. And lastly, this one. So that's my 33rd or 34th truck. Counting doubles and the same trucks, I think I have 19 or 20 all together, but this is the collection so far as of January 31st, 2019, with a lot more to come, and I'm still looking for those fire and ice, so hopefully I'll find them pretty soon, and I hope you guys like the video.